Outlander Season 4 has been one of the most exciting chapters of the star's time-traveling drama to date, as Jamie Fraser has finally met his grown daughter Brianna Randall Fraser after she traveled through the Standing Stones to find him. But now author Diana Gabaldon has revealed his character could have undergone an unbelievable change. When Outlander fans think of the brooding red-headed Scott Jamie Fraser, many couldn't dream of picturing him any other way than Glaswegian actor Sam Hewen. But it turns out, American author Diana initially had two very different actors in mind, and what's more, they are a lot older than the 37-year-old who eventually won the part. Speaking in a recent interview, the Southern writer shared, This was years ago when I was first approached about adapting Outlander. It was when it was a feature film, too, she told E! News. Explaining Liam Neeson and Sean Connery were the first contenders for Jamie, Diana's bombshell would have meant a very different Jamie if they'd actually been chosen for the hit TV series. This would have been unlikely, as by the time creator Ronald D. Moore and his co-executive producer Meryl Davis were casting for the Stars program, both Liam and Sean were in their 50s and 80s, respectively. Season 1 of the show sees Claire Fraser, Katrina Balfe, meet Jamie at the tender age of 22, which was already a leap for the then 30-something actor Sam. Despite his incredible work on the series, Diana has also admitted in the past she struggled to get on board with Sam in the role at first. Having seen photos of the star in his theater work and other intense performances, she called his appearance grotesque, but this was quickly changed. Recalling her opinions, Diana told the publication, People say, do, Sam and Katrina, look just like your imagination? And I'm like, well, how could they? But they don't need to. What an actor does is magic, the writer added. While Sam and Katrina have become seasoned pros at portraying their characters' marriage on screen, this year has seen newcomer Ed Spilliers join the cast as evil pirate Stephen Bonnet. In an interview with Express.co.uk, the Downton Abbey star revealed the comparisons to original antagonist Black Jack Randall, Tobias Menzies, were daunting. I think it was an exciting thing, he began. Because Tobias Menzies is such a brilliant actor and to be able to be in any way mentioned in the same sentence as someone who's as good as him is a lovely thing. But of course there's always pressures taking on anything with such a huge following and massive support. Of course there's pressure. There's enough pressure, already, with trying to approach a character as an actor and feel that you are giving a true portrayal of who you think a character is, the star explained. Then put on the added bonus of worrying about perception, and if you put on the pressure of filling someone else's shoes, I think that's an exciting thing. I try not to think too much about the pressure because it's detrimental to my life anyway. There are enough stresses as an actor and as humans anyway so I think you have to relish the opportunity. Ed added, it's been a great pleasure to get into Stephen Bonnet's head, though, at times testing, but it's been a pleasure.